Disney has released the penultimate episode of their Star Wars series, The Bad Batch, which finds the Bad Batch crew fighting against the odds as they operate behind enemy lines and make their way towards the heart of the Tantus base. And while the episode was definitely packed with some fun and exciting action sequences, I can't deny the fact that I was underwhelmed by the episode overall. Because while nothing about the episode was inherently bad, I guess I was just expecting to see more from the penultimate episode of the series. The Bad Batch is finally coming to an end, and yet I still have so many questions that have gone unanswered. Like, what happened to CX2? Are we gonna get a better look at Project Necromancer? Was Asajj Ventress really brought back from the dead for no reason at all? Is Tech actually dead? What's going to happen with all of the clones who are still loyal to the Empire even after this series ends? Because you would think that the Bad Batch crew would go on to be involved with the Age of Rebellion, but they have never been seen in any subsequent Star Wars stories. So do they all just die in the upcoming finale, or do they simply give up in trying to save their clone brothers from the Empire? I mean, as much as I would like to see these characters retire and settle down on Pabu to live happily ever after, I just have a hard time believing that they wouldn't go on to help in the fight against the Empire. So what are they going to do after they escape from Tantis? Now, granted, I don't need to have all of these questions answered before the finale, I just have a hard time believing that the finale will be able to reach a satisfying conclusion with all of these lingering questions left up in the air. Because with the way this story appears to be heading, I'm sure that the finale is going to be fast paced and action packed, and that is totally fine, there's nothing wrong with wanting to go out on a bang, I just hope that the episode will also take the time to allow for more insightful plot developments along with some strong character moments too. But I guess we'll find out how the finale of The Bad Batch will actually turn out to be when it premieres on Wednesday.